I done messed it up. Messed it up. Now I gotta fix it, yeah. Let's zoom out. Just a tad. A little bit low. Why it looks so shiny? Good morning, um, good evening, internet. It's sunny. And uh, today is my birthday. Yay! I'm 32. Um, I was born at 9.03 p.m. So 32 years ago, I would have been 30 minute, 20 minutes old. So that's crazy. Uh, it's been a good 32 years. I want to thank my mom and dad for making me. And yeah, so that's awkward. Anyways. To all the people that uh, have posted on my Facebook wall wishing me a happy birthday, thank you so much. I love you so much. Uh, I wish the best for you. Thank you so much for thinking of me on my birthday. I wanted to share with you what I got for my birthday. Um, first, my dad gave me $32 and I put it in my little piggy bank over there. Uh, it has a total of $54 now. Thanks, Dad. Um, my mother which I was so excited to see her. She made me homemade shampoo. Now, I have not used this yet. I usually don't wash my hair too much. I'm, that sounds bad. But I use conditioner to wash my hair because with this natural hair, you can't get it to dry it out. But she swears up and down that you don't need conditioner with this. So I'm going to take her word for it. It's got all kinds of Indian herbs and spices in it. I don't know. We're going to see. Thank you so much, Mom. She also made me some homemade hair butter. Now this stuff, I put it on my hair today, it is magical. And it smells like chocolate because of the cocoa butter. I like that a lot. So thank you so much for this. It looks very creamy and moisturizing and it looks white, but when you rub it in, it becomes transparent. Oh my God, look. Put that in my hair. Anyways, so yeah, that's pretty cool. So thank you so much, Mother, for that. I might hit you up for some more. Then my sister got me this totally cool Texas Rangers hat and it's sparkly. Yes, I love the sparkles. I love glitter. So this is perfect now. I got my hair done right now. So it's not really going to fit my, my, with my, with my afro. I have to like straighten my hair to get that on. So, but thank you so much JT for this. I love it. Love, love, love. Cannot wait for ranger season. Napoli's back. Yeah. But now this gift that another gift that my sister gave me is, um, I don't know if you can see this, this, you put it over your head, your mouth goes here and then you put your hands right here so you can lay on your desk or something or on the plane or something and go to sleep. Now, I got makeup on. I'm going to attempt to put this on my head so you can see how ridiculous this is. Like when I first saw it, I'm like, why in the world did you give me this? Why? And then I was like thinking, I was like, you know, this is kind of legit. So here we go. Oh God. So it kind of goes like this. And then you put your hands in here and you can just go like that so that's what JT gave me oh my gosh I bet you has makeup all over it yes it does yes it does sorry JT and she just washed it so thank you so much for this JT and then I bought a little something for myself I do it every um, birthday uh, I bought some eyeshadow so I don't know if you can see the eyeshadow that I don't want to get too close that makes my imperfections come out but um, I bought a Pepe sticker I don't know if you're familiar with Pepe it's very very I don't know prevalent with the Trump movement now I have a confession to make now I was not a fan of Trump all the way up until the election even after the election not a fan at all he's starting to grow on me 
every single time I see protests and anti-Trump movements are beating up people and calling people Hitler or Nazis. I mean, with the views that I have, I would be called a Nazi. And people think it's okay to punch Nazis. I just... You made me, the left, the radical left, have made me a Trump fan. And that's just, that's just, it's weird for me to say. I mean, it is. But I am on board. I'm on board. I'm on board the Trump train. And I, there's, that it's your fault, left, is the radical left, it's your fault. I was not a fan of Trump. I was vehemently against him in the election. Did not vote for him. But now I like him. And it's your fault. Thanks a lot. I don't mind it. You know, I'm going to get the hate. It's okay. But it's my birthday. Nothing can bring me down. So again, thank you so much for your kind words and uh, your comments and things like that for my birthday. I hope you have a great day. And I will go do the same. Bye, guys. Oops. <laughs>